The SeaTac Flow VPX system works in line directly into your downstream process, creating a measure of control previously unheard of. Whether chromatography or ultrafiltration diafiltration, the Flow VPX system integrates directly into your skid and offers real time concentration measurements for your sample ranging from 0.1 to 300 mg per mil. Today we'll go over how to install the Flow VPX instrument into your lab bench. The Flow VPX system incorporates a Carry 60 spectrophotometer and a ruggedized computer included with the system and requires access to a power outlet. Pass the detector cable and the SMA hex nut end of the delivery fiber through the open accessory port at the back of the Carry 60 into the sample compartment. Connect the black right angle plug of the detector cable into the wall of the Carry 60 sample compartment. Connect the Carry 60 power cable to the back of the Carry 60, then connect the plug into an approved outlet. Power on the Carry 60 by pressing the power button. The Carry 60 will begin calibration and the power button will turn green once completed. Connect the Carry 60 USB cable, which is supplied with the Carry 60, to the back panel of the Carry 60. Connect the other end to a USB port on the computer. Connect the SMA end of the delivery fiber to the threaded splice bushing at the back of the fiber optic coupler. Use the hex nut to securely tighten the connection. Connect the Flow VPX power and input output IO splitter cable to the top of the Flow VPX head. Next, connect the Flow VPX power supply to the power and IO splitter cable. The Flow VPX system is capable of 4 to 20 milliamp analog output. The Flow VPX system is also capable of input output connections with several devices. To utilize the Flow VPX IO connections, connect the IO external cable to the power and IO splitter cable. Next, connect the USB cable to the USB communications connector on the top of the Flow VPX head. Connect the Flow VPX USB cable to a USB port on the computer. Plug the Flow VPX country specific power cable into an approved outlet. Run the Viper software on the computer by double clicking the program icon on the desktop. The Viper console will then open and conduct a calibration of the Carry 60. Before running any process in the software, ensure the console says ready and the Carry 60 power button is green. Enter your username and password in the indicated fields, which is provided upon installation. Congratulations, your Flow VPX system has now been installed. For other helpful videos, please refer to our website.